I've been told to love myself. I try, but I can never understand. It's Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. I've got a sty in my eye, can you believe it? And I had to go to the pharmacy today to get some eye drops. Allergy with antihistamine clears and relieves itchy red and sore eyes. So I've put two drops into my eyes, but today, or well this evening I should say, I'm gonna do a facial skin peel. I'm gonna do it at home here in the bathroom. And what it is, is it's a anti-aging glycolic peel on my skin and it's by L'Oreal. These are the products that I've got. So step one is the actual peel itself. Step two is the post peel neutralizer. And step three is the correcting anti-aging moisturizer. So for this mature skin of mine, Today I'm going to show you how I do this skin peel using glycolic acid products by L'Oreal. So if you're interested to see me do my face, do a skin peel, then please keep watching. As always, the first thing you have to do is take off all your makeup, every little ounce of it. So taking off, look at that. This is just taking off the last stages of my makeup and as soon as I apply product to my face you can see now I'm starting to get really blotchy and flames, flames on the side of my face and red. I don't know why this happens every time I either do a facial or I do a peel of some sort or just applying any product to my face. So. It's still not clean enough, so I'm going to use the Glycolic Clarifying Cleanser by De Lewins. And this is a really deep cleanser, and it's got the glycolic acid, which is great for your skin. So it's designed to remove just not only the uh, makeup, but also the residue that's left on there after you've, you've thought you've, um, you've cleansed your face. Well, it says without causing any skin irritation, so I don't know whether it is or not. Like I said, with my skin, everything seems to irritate it. So, so I'm going to wet my Halo facial uh, washer just with some lukewarm water. I'm going to apply the clarifying glycolic cleanser. So just basically a few pumps onto the washer and let's have a look at what comes off my face. Can you see that? That's the residue of my makeup that's just come off. And then we can start the peel. Okay, so this is the peel concentrate and I'm to apply one dose onto a rem uh, makeup removal pad. So just placing it on the pad, one dose. And then I'm to apply this all over. Oh my God, look at this. I'm to apply it all over my face. The five minutes are up and this is what's happened to my skin. It's red, it's blotchy and it doesn't look very good at all. But we're going to proceed with this. So the next step is the post peel neutralizer. Now you can't leave a glycolic peel on your face without neutralizing it because it'll just burn you I think so with this particular step you're going to need a makeup pad douse the pad significantly with a lot of this post neutral solution and then just wipe it all over your face so now I'm taking the glycolic peel off by neutralizing it with this solution I can actually feel it quite tingly so I mean that is the rule of thumb that if your skin is reacting to it in a pleasant kind of a way not a burning way then it's doing its job okay so now we're down to the third and final step 
where I'm going to apply several dots uh, all over my face and then smooth the cream in to the center uh, to the outside of my face and I repeat these movements until the cream has been completely has been completely dissolved so here we go dot 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 so in other words the actual uh, post peel solution you don't wash off you leave it on your face and now this third, third step is just to apply the moisturizer now this is giving it a real cooling effect so hopefully it will cool down my redness the redness in on me never lasts it can possibly stay red for a couple of hours and then it just calms down and I should be okay by the morning according to this particular product you're supposed to do a facial mask or a skin peel at least twice a week in order to um, keep your skin vibrant energized exfoliated cleansed and the, and the like never go to bed with makeup on always make sure you re, you remove all your makeup you cleanse your face you exfoliate um, at least twice a week and moisturize all the time day and night my skin routine is twice a day I do a morning routine and I do a night routine so tell me what your routines are let me know in the commentary box below and um, if you've got any questions then please also leave those comments in the in the box below I'm gonna now brush my teeth and I'm gonna get ready for bed so thank you again for watching I hope this redness goes down and I shall look forward to seeing you in my next video if you're new to my channel again please don't forget to subscribe give me a thumbs up and make sure you click that notification bell bye for now and good night